Let's now shift our attention to the Electoral Commission, where two persons in the one municipality of the Upper West region have been apprehended at the one municipal office of the Electoral Commission after they attempted to register twice on the limited voter registration exercise we started today. Now, according to the one municipal director of the EC, Ben Kujo Alagalo, the two were stopped from registering after they saw an alert on registration devices showing that they had earlier registered and their names were already captured on the voters' register. Join us's Upper West Regional Correspondent Rafiq Salam report from what? The one municipal office of the Electoral Commission, located on the outskirts of the War Township and on the one Nakuru Road, is the venue of the EC Limited Registration Exercise. Close to three dozen prospective registrants were already going through the registration process, whilst others sat patiently waiting for their turn. It is a peaceful atmosphere and the process well choreographed and coordinated. There have neither been any report of system failure nor software malfunctioned. As a result of that, two persons who registered in the last registration exercise and want to have another bite of the pie were easily identified and rejected by the registration devices prompting the one municipal officer of the EC, Ben Kujo Adagulu, to sound the warning bells. When you go to the room and the machine detects that you have registered it already, please will not forgive you, will arrest you. So far, two people have been hurt, detected, for attempting to register twice. Ben Adagulu faded to light on the issue. Uh, those that were the attempting, the two that were caught attempting to register again, uh, probably we have to let them go because they told us that they registered in 2016, not knowing it was registration done in 2020. So probably the benefit of the doubt, we have allowed them to go. Probably if anybody comes again and we see that he's attempting to register twice, but before they will not even allow it to happen, we shall be giving on spot education, publicity, as you saw me in the first instant doing, we'll be telling them that please, it is not a fresh registration, but a registration for those who are qualified in that manner to do so. Three hours after the start of the registration, more than 40 persons had registered and handed over their voter registration card. Two of them spoke to us on why they think acquiring the voter ID card is necessary. The economic is hard. Just right now, I'm not feeling anything. I just finished uh, World Technical Institute this year. I'm not getting any job right now. So you think that your your vote will determine your fate? Inshallah, by the grace of Allah. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you'll be traveling. You ask of your voter ID card or a Ghana card. If you're not having it, it can be a problem. It's because of the will to have it. Meanwhile, the situation at the Lembuse District Office of the Electoral Commission is out of a different. Several prospective voters who trunk the center are unable to do so as a result of the malfunctioning of the registration devices. They stayed for close to three hours waiting for the challenge to affect who they were unable to do, forcing them to move away. NDC Lembuse parliamentary candidate for the 2024 general election, Dr. Tatius Bayou, who was at the registration center, expressed worry over the high issues in the registration process. It's about 11 a.m. on the first day of registration, and as of this time, not a single person has been able to register. They are facing technical challenges, the system is down. The first person that attempted the registration, they've been able to take a picture, but they cannot save. A lot of young people were here, and after waiting for three hours and not able to register, they have walked home. This is a frustration in this part of the country. People have traveled from farther part of this district to the district capital, and as at 11 a.m., not one person has been able to register. How do you progress from here? This is a clear case of voter suppression in the people of Ghana. Reporting for the news, Rafik Salam. Wow.